Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install python 3.12.6 that is the latest version on Windows 10 or Windows 11. Then we will see how to run the hello world python code example. First go to python official website that is python.org. Hit enter. Then click on downloads. See here the latest stable version is python 3.12.6. If you scroll down, see here we have the different versions like 3.12.61, 3.9 etc. Okay, but if you want specific, specific versions, you can download from here. Just you need to click on this download button for these versions. See, Python 3.12.6 is released on September 16, 2024. Click on download Python 3.12.6. See, once we click done, download has been started. See, it's a size is 25.3 megabytes download is completed just click on this python exe file click on it the installation process is same on both windows 10 or 11 are servers also then select the checkbox that is add python.exe to, to to the path then here two types of installations direct and custom installation see for this installation this is the path but if custom installation we can select the location and features so it is up to you see these are the optional features okay next see this is the custom location if you want to change the location you have to click on this browse then select the path then click on install okay this is the one way also if you want to install python 3.12.6 for all users you have to select this checkbox then click on install We have successfully installed the python. Click on close. Now go to start. If you scroll down, see here we have the python 3.12. Folder is there. See, we can run the commands by using this idle or this python shell or cmd then type python. See, we have installed python 3.12.6. This is the one way. The other ways are Windows run. Just give python. See, python 3.12.6. Then, the, by using IDL, python IDL. Go to python folder. Open this python. IDL. See, the version of python is python 3.12.6 okay the other way is python shell from the same folder click on this python see we have already opened this one okay these are the four ways okay now open python ideal now we will see how to run sample python programs simply run the print hello world close the close the quotations hit enter this is from python ideal shell from cmd also we can run the same python then run the print hello see this is the string so you must give in singular double quotes no need to give the semicolon Okay, see this is the output. We can run the programs here or here also. Okay, now run some mathematical or arithmetic operations 3 plus 2, 3 minus 2, 100 into 50. Okay, 100 divided by 50, it is modulus 100 percentile 40 it will give the remainder. You can also define the variables a equals 100 b equals to 200 
c equals to a plus b d equals to a minus b e equals to a divided by b c comma d comma e see here first one is sum second one is subtraction and third one is the division okay you can also create this sample python program and compile it go to command prompt control g to quit or exit from python shell now type notepad plus plus r just give notepad then give the python c if we create a file it will be stored in this directory if you want to create file in c drive now give the notepad then example dot example one dot py py is the extension word for the python program python file click on s See, I don't have permissions. Let me go to this directory. CD. Now run the same notepad. Example. On dot py. Now type print. Hello world. Welcome to Arto Schools. A equals to 500, B equals to 300, C equals to A plus B, D equals to A minus B, E equals to A times B. Print c comma d comma e save the file file then save now we can compile it by running the python example one dot py see this is the output of that file see first line contains let me open the file see first line is just printing hello world and second line see these are only variable definitions and this is the print command so it is going to print c c is sum of two numbers so these these two are the sum of numbers and d is subtraction and e is multiplication okay so the, here also we can run the other way is go to here then file then click on open then go to that path see here we have the example dot one click on open now select run and run the module see we got the same output like here see we got the same output okay okay so in this video we have seen how to download and install python 3.12.6 on windows 10 or 11 operating system then we have seen the hello world and other examples then we have seen how to compile python file on windows operating systems for more python videos please subscribe my channel thank you